This is a story of how global health brings hope after destruction. On how global health prevents, detects, and responds to disasters. Two powerful cyclones made landfall in Mozambique in March and April of 2019. Cyclone Idai was the first one and has been recorded as the second deadliest tropical cyclone in the Southwest Indian Ocean Basin. Getting to the affected areas was very difficult. We found destroyed health centers. There was no electricity or running water. Debris was everywhere and mold was starting to build up in the remaining structures. From experience, we know that when resources and facilities are impacted, there is a great potential for disease outbreaks. Working with the Mozambican health authorities, specifically the National Institute for Health, the World Health Organization, and other partners, we set up an Early Warning Alert and Response System, or EWARS. During humanitarian emergencies, detecting and responding quickly to disease outbreaks is key to reduce illness and death. EWARS is often the only source for health data collection after a disaster that disrupts routine public health surveillance systems. EWARS training was conducted and epidemiologists started working on disease outbreaks, including cholera. A total of 900,000 people were vaccinated. CDC and UNICEF trained and deployed water, sanitation, and hygiene assistance teams. CDC also supported malaria prevention and response work. In partnership with USAID, malaria bed nets were distributed as part of the cholera vaccination campaign. In Mozambique, it is tradition to finish conversations with the phrase, estamos juntos, or we are together. It truly describes the collaboration and positive results of our global health work emergency response. 